Hi guys, it's Coach Henry here showing you guys the second video of our handling low shots, ground strokes series and look forward to hearing from you guys in our private lessons. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and share with your friends so that more friends can benefit. So I'm going to demonstrate on a low ball, sometimes one step might not be enough. You're trying to get underneath the ball and you're going to step in and trying to bend the knees and get up to the ball but sometimes one big giant step is not good. So what we're going to do, we're going to do a shuffle step. So for example on the forehand I'm a right-handed player so I'm going to go left foot, right left. Okay, and then recover, left, right, left. So the timing is ch -ch -ch timing, right? So on the forehand is left, right, left. On the backhand, I'm a right-handed player. For the backhand is right, left, right. And recover. So I'm gonna do a few for you guys, and hopefully um, you guys can see me in this camera angle. On the forehand, hit the shot, recover. And you can see that I'm not trying to smash the ball as high as I can. I'm trying to finesse, get underneath the ball, and on the backhand, as right, left, right, stay low. And make sure you finish the shot first before you pop back up and recover so that you can complete the shot with a nice execution and then you can execute the stuff afterwards. So in our lessons, we help our students understand more about low ball and high ball in feeding and rallying methods. We look forward to hearing from you guys. And please subscribe to our YouTube channel so more friends can benefit. Look forward to hearing from you guys soon.